Hello and welcome to another Indie Horror Game demo. This time it's the demo to The Inheritance of Crimson Manor, and if you want to find out a little bit more about this, I'll leave the links and the details down below in the description. So, a few members of a prestigious family have all died under mysterious circumstances, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to their old Victorian manor home, and I'm going to have a little poke around, see what they left behind, and maybe uncover some secrets. Expect a little bit of horror, a little bit of mystery, and a whole lot of puzzle solving. I really hope you enjoy it. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Like the video if you did enjoy this at the end, alright? Here we go, a new game. So, after working for more than 10 years as the private assistant of the enigmatic railroad magnate Hadley Strange, the news of his sudden death along his entire family takes you by surprise. As I imagined it would. Now you've been appointed as the executor in charge of fulfilling his last will and take care of his majestic manor, a luxurious property on the outskirts of London. Lucky me. Alright, maybe I killed them. I don't know. <laughs> Upon your arrival at the mansion, you found a cryptic set of instructions that could make you change your mind about who your former employer really was. Is that right? Okay. And here we are. Okay, so delve into the mansion and investigate why Mr. Strange appointed you as his executor. Right. Or I could leave. Oh, I can't leave now. I've still got business to resolve. Oh, damn it. Okay. <laughs> right. Okay, we can read this? We can read this. Okay, the Victorian Post. Tragedy in the Thames. Oh, there you go. A plain text version. All members of the renowned Strange family have lost their lives in a tragic and mysterious boat accident. The reasons for the accident are still unknown. Rescuers continue to search for the bodies of the five members of the strange family. Oh, interesting. So the bodies weren't actually found? Hmm, maybe they faked their own death. Hmm. And did I see news of a, a new paper cutting machine? Oh my goodness. There we go. Right. So... Oh, the door seems to be unlocked, but one doorknob is missing. I can see that, actually, so I need to find a way to open the door to the hall. Okay, well, there's there's no doorknobs or anything around here. Let's have a little look, shall we? Okay, nothing unusual here. Can I grab that cane? I've always wanted a cane. <laughs> oh, we've got something here. Oh, dear probate conservator. By express instructions of the deceased, you are the only person authorized to enter his office and give initial reading of his will. Please do so as soon as possible in order to locate the heirs and proceed with the corresponding testamentary process. P.S. One of the front doorknobs has been damaged during my visit. Please add it to the pending repairs list prior to the execution of the will. I have placed the fallen knob inside one of the bottom drawers on the entrance closet, like the place I'm looking right now. Thanks, Lionel. Okay. Well, that looks like a pocket watch to me. Hmm, yeah. A broken one is in disrepair. I'm gonna put that back. Ah, there it is. Okay, so we have an inventory. Fair enough. Right, okay, so I can't take the cane. Ah, oh, damn it. And there's nothing there? No, okay. Right, so we, we don't take the documents with us, it seems, but we do take certain items. And we still can't leave? We still can't leave, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Still more to do. Ah, right, so I... Uh, equip? Okay. Alright, I think I'm getting the hang of this. So far, so good. I'm enjoying what I'm seeing. And here we are. Wow. Alright. Big place. And yeah, very luxurious. Look at that ceiling. So I need to find the private office and look for the will inside the desk. What's this? Oh, it looks like... Oh, we, we've actually got a map as well. Okay. Oh, jeez. Wow, this really is a big place. So we've got four floors. The basement, floor one. Floor two. There's the attic as well. That's not too big. The basement... No, that's not too big either. But, uh... Wow, floor, floors one and two. Big boys. Okay, so... Let's see. The office... There's a study over there. Would it be upstairs, do you think, maybe? There's a private room. That could be it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking it's probably one of those two, so let's stay on this floor and let's just explore, shall we? So what have we got here? Tobacco? Okay. 
and a photo. A heliography on paper. I had heard of them, but this is the first time I've seen one. Right. Hadley and Nicholas Strange, circa 1883. Both presumably dead now. Hmm. Okay. And there he is. There's the big man up there. What secrets does he hide? Oh, hang on. Ah, oh, I thought I was going to pick up the cane, but no, the chair's recently used. Interesting. This one? This hasn't been recently used, apparently. I don't know how I can ascertain that, but... Okay. Um, well, let's just sort of go around the room and, and see what we can find. Okay. Okay, old dusty stacks of papers. There's a lot of interactivity, isn't there? Wow. Okay. That door's locked. Okay, do I update this on the map? No, it doesn't seem like it. In fact, it doesn't show me the doors at all. Fair enough, though. Fair enough. Something over here? Uh, nope. Okay. This feels like a game where I'm going to have to sort of sink my teeth into the nitty-gritty details, you know? Crimson blood. Ooh. That looks a lot like this hall, doesn't it? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Funny coincidence, probably. Yeah, okay. Alright, that works. That would allow me to go towards the art room and the parlor, the dining room in the back. And I suppose access the stairs that will get me into the basement. Uh, let's see then. Oh boy. Oh. Well, this, this is going to be a puzzle, isn't it? The old clock doesn't seem to work. Until I pull these in the right order, probably. Hmm. Okay, I, I guess I'll, I'll be coming back to this, I imagine. What's this? My little doll's room. Volume 3. Oh, here we are. Oh, it's a little fold-out, pop-out book. Nice. Very clever. There's probably a detail here that I should take note of. But I, I can't tell what it's going to be, so I'm just going to put that back, yeah, okay. I'll keep that in mind. I love the music, by the way. It's evoking that sort of scratches feel to me. Exploring the, uh, exploring the house for the first time in scratches. And that's always good. That's always very, very good. Right, so... That opens as well. That goes to the same corridor, I suppose. Uh, nothing unusual here, are you sure? <laughs> what about down here? What's all this? Nothing unusual again? Mmm, alright. I'll take your word for it. What's this? Dear Miss Thomas, I have lost my pocket watch somewhere in my office. I count on your valuable collaboration to find it. When done, please leave the key to my desk inside the mail organizer in the hall outside the library. Okay, they... In the hall outside the library. I might be able to find the key. Key to the desk as well. Okay. So where is the library? Okay, the library's over here. It's not too far away. We'll probably be going that way in a moment if the door is going to be open. And it is. That's good. Uh, anything else? Binoculars? Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I like the fact that we can, you know, spin this around. We can have a look at it from every angle. I don't think there's any details to see on this thing, but maybe there's going to be something to find on something else. Okay. What's that? Ink, I think. <laughs> uh-huh. Yep, yeah, all right. In here? Oh, there is something down here. The Continental Union Telegram. Okay. In this Honourable Scientific Council, we see, with extreme concern, the conclusions submitted in your article about the research titled Eugenic Transliteration. The procedures described in your paper are beyond unacceptable to the ethical values of this scientific society and must be stopped immediately. Be fulfilled! <laughs> I don't know if he was fulfilled. Hmm. Ah. Mrs. Strange. Again, presumably dead. Right, so, um... It seems like this is the way we need to go. That's going to lead to, you know, potentially the study, the, the key. So let's go this way. <laughs> That's just how I work. That's how I operate. Oh, this is locked as well, is it? Okay. So we can go around. But, uh... It looks like the only way to go, at least on this floor, is this way. So let's see. This way. Nope, that's locked from the other side. Fair enough, fair enough. So, would it be... Okay, the study is here. Is this his private office? It could very well be. Wasn't it supposed to be inside the desk? 
The central drawer is locked. There you go. Yeah, so this is it. This is the private office. The will should be in there. I just need to find a way to open the desk drawer. And I think that means I need to go and find some sort of typewriter puzzle. No, I need to go and find the key. Okay. Each and every key seems to work. Um, I, I don't know what I need to type in, but presumably I need to type in something. Okay. I'm not going to take this with me, just in case. Okay, it is just this central drawer. Yeah, the other ones do open. Let's see, let's go from the bottom up. Oh, what's this? Oh, hang on, no, no, no I, I could definitely have a look at that. The brave legionary soldier switched his side. He wears off his red uniform to wear a green one. Now with a colourful feathers, blue hat, and high boots in black. He wields a long sabre now, always ready and always sharp. He then started to march, willing even to lose his life, to protect the lives of those who with devotion and loyalty fight, along him protecting the right cause. Okay. Fair enough. He's changed his uniform. Good for him. Can't seem to turn this around. There's nothing on the back. But, okay. Mm, letters, correspondence, odd little things, but nothing of any real value. Um, what was that? Incredibly. <laughs> Incredibly. Okay. Right, let's go from the bottom up again. Nothing, no. Oh. A wax seal with the family heraldry. Oh, nice. Lovely little emblem. Lovely little symbol there. Okay. More incredible blue. Yeah, more incredible blue. Uh, I think that's it, really. Okay, fair enough. So, let's just have a little look around here as well. She went to the cobblers to buy him some shoes, but when she came back, he was reading the news. Oh my god, this dog. This dog. Cigarettes. And cigars, hello. No? Oh, come on, this is all yours! <laughs> Make use of it. And there's more in the box, too. Okay, oh, bottles of wine. Oh, what's in the chest? Oh. Okay, well, there's something. Scarlet Widow. Hmm, okay. Maybe this is an allusion to what happened to the family. I don't know. Interesting. Candelabra down there. A uh, bunch of stuff on the shelves. Oh, okay, yep, so there's, there's cupboards down here as well. Bloody hell. This is so detailed. It looks really, really good. It plays really well, too. What's this? Oh, God, what is this? Oh, well, this is, this is definitely a puzzle. Okay, well, um, we're looking for something. We're looking for something that's going to tell us what this is. Uh, and then I'm going to find something inside it, I guess. Okay. We have a map of the world, right. A beautiful sea route planning world map, indeed. Nothing marked on it? What's this? After travelling around the world to explore three different remote islands, my way of seeing the world changed forever. And there's that seal again. Three remote islands. Three different remote islands. Okay. Fair enough. Do we have to find them here? Hmm. I'm just kind of looking at it from the side. We're just wondering if some of these are going to be, like, buttons sticking out, but I don't think so. Right. What's this? Oh. Oh, hey, okay, well, I think we found uh, a puzzle. Well, hang on. What was that thing? Where was it? I think it was in the bottom desk drawer, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, blue hats, black boots, green uniform. So let's see. Black boots, green uniform, blue hats. Hey, there you go. We've completed our first puzzle, and we get... A chemical battery, a modern device that stores electrical energy. Okay. And what would this be? Oh, I see, that just goes back and forth between the inventory and the map, which also tells us the objective. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, so chemical battery, that could come in handy, I suppose. Cool. Anything else? No, I don't think so. The old man's gaze seems to hide something. Hmm. Don't take this the wrong way, mate, but I kind of want to knife your face. Is there something behind that painting? Nothing here. Oh, oh, here we are. 
Oh, right. Uh, well, maybe this is where we would find these islands. Is it Hawaii somewhere? I, I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure at the moment, but uh, I guess I'll be coming back to this. That's probably something to do with that note, if I had to guess. Okay, so we've done a little bit of a loop. We've got a chemical battery. We still haven't opened the drawer, though, unfortunately, so... Let's see. Just outside the library. Isn't that what she said? Okay. The library... The library is actually to my left. Which we can also go in. Goodness. Hold on, though. Hold on. What have we got here? Uh, ah, there it is! There it is! Oh, no, no, that's not what I was trying to pick up, but uh, it's a photo of... Uh, well, is that is that the library behind me? Oh. When you are open to look at problems from a new perspective, even the darkest situations suddenly become clear. Thanks for that. But the desk key, a small, solid gold key. Right, we should probably use that, but okay. Interesting. Very interesting, okay. And then that way, right. Before we continue exploring, let's see if we can get this desk open. Let's uh, let's not get ahead of ourselves. So let's see. Equip. Yeah. Okay. This is good. This is really really good. I hope you guys are enjoying it because, in all likelihood, I am going to be playing the full game when it does come out, and it looks like it's pretty much ready to go as well. So it might not take too long. Anyway, what's this? We must pay attention to our children sometimes. They have key things to be said in very unusual ways. There's the typewriter. A-R-E. Or Ray, or Rhea, or... Okay. Nothing on the back of this one, but yeah, okay. So maybe if I just type those letters in? And here we go, this is the will. Along with the will, there is a note that reads, Listen to the child so that the old man reveals my secret legacy. Along the same sort of lines as this. Let's see. A R E. R E A. A E R? Ear? No? Okay. Uh, yep. Not really sure about that, but fair enough. Okay. So it's just the will in this note, is it? Right. Can sort of zoom in to kind of read it if we hold right click. Yeah, okay, alright. Um... So yeah, no clue about that at the moment. A little bit confused about this. No clue regarding that either. Should we move on? Maybe we should go to the library. Yeah, let's go in here, shall we? Okay. Goodness gracious me. Yeah, I think that photo that I saw was maybe taken from up here somewhere? Like, looking at the books down here? Yeah. Okay, so hang on, let's just, let's just do a bit of a loop, let's go around. We've actually got some blocks, maybe this is it. I don't like this word. Every time my father yells it, he makes us take more medicines with a strange taste that makes me feel weird. Especially the most recent red one. I never want to take it again. Oh dear, okay. Okay, so we're just switching these around. So hang on, maybe uh, the, e, the green E needs to go there. It'll be Eureka, right? After ordering the blocks, spelling this word, they stay fixed in this position. Interesting. Very interesting. What we got here? The Butcher of Oxford Street. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm seeing a theme in these. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing there. I do wonder. Maybe I should... Right, I'm going to do that before I forget. I am going to see if I can just type Eureka into the typewriter. Maybe that's what he was getting at. So... E -u -m -m -m. Hmm. With that... That's right! And there is something behind him. It's a safe. And 7... 745. 745? 745, apparently. Okay. Right. Um, 
That clock that wasn't working out in the hall, possibly. These numbers behind the canvas were recently painted. Okay. And of course the safe is locked, so now I need to find I need to find a key to the safe. Not a combination, but a key. Right. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Okay, well. This is great. This is uh This is piquing my curiosity. It's quite titillating, quite honestly. <laughs> I'm gonna keep on going with this. So, nothing else to find. Can't start the fire. We have another clock here. But I can't open this door. I can't mess with the pendulum. No, okay. 7.45, you say. Very, very detailed. Okay, let's see. I do repent, but heaven hath pleased it so to punish me with this, and this with me. That I must be the scourge and minister. I will bestow him, and will answer well the death I give him. So again, good night. I must be cruel only to be kind. Thus bad begins and worse remains behind. This is perhaps my favourite line from Shakespeare's work. I must be cruel only to be kind. Were you being cruel to your kids to be kind to them? By feeding them these weird medicines? Hmm. Well, this is the important bit. I must be cruel only to be kind. Probably a, probably a clue to something. Right, what is this? Uh, okay. Uh, uh, oh! Uh, yes. <laughs> okay, it looks like we've got the entirety of the alphabet here. Uh, what do I do with it? Do I just rearrange it? Wait, wait, hang on, hang on. Can I make that phrase out in the books? I must be cruel. Well, I, mm, I don't, I don't think so. Maybe some of it? Maybe I could write out cruel or something? I mean, there's, there's two eyes. We'd, yeah, we'd, we'd use the N twice and... Yeah, um... Alright. Well, that's, that's a thing. Fair enough. Plenty of books around here, but these ones I want to... I want to use. And it is just moving them around. Possibly down there. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put everything back. Yeah. I don't really know what I'm doing there at the moment. I'll come back to this. Stacked shelves. Nothing out of place? Mmm I don't think so. Nothing that I can see anyway. Uh no. No, I don't believe so. Right, so here we are. What's in the center here? Can I start reading? Wait, what's this? Oh? Nothing happens. It seems that I need some kind of power source. Right. Well, I, I do have a power source of sorts. And it, yeah, I think this is I think this is due to be hooked up, so I've got to equip it and use it here. Right, try again. Okay. Now we get the pink light. Fair enough. Oh, 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 now we're talking. These symbols are somewhat familiar to me, but there's something about them that doesn't fit. Right. So, yeah, one of these is going to be, one of these is going to be the combination to that box in the study, isn't it? Okay. And we can turn this off? We can. I don't think I want to do that, but... Yeah, let's, let's turn it back on. I can't pull the books out and rearrange them or anything, right? No. No. Okay. Well, before we, you know, take note of this and then see if we can open that, let's, uh, let's go upstairs, shall we? So, again, more books. Funny that. It's almost like it's a library. And what have we got here? The Raven. Oh, boy. Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered weak and weary. There's a little bit of Poe for you. What's this? Funnily enough, it's another puzzle. Looks like we're sort of moving these books around again. Okay. Um, right. Uh, I. Hmm. Should that go there? Is that your elbow, or is that? Hold on. Maybe that's the end to that. Uh, 
that looks about right. But not quite like that, possibly. I, mm, mm, I don't know. Ah! There you are! There you are! Okay, fantastic. Uh, so we've got a gas lighter. Alright. Again, that could come in very handy. Nothing that I can really do with it right now. Can't inspect it. No, okay, I'm just going to quit. And um, there's this too. May the seal guide you to see what's hidden from the human eye. Right. I think I did see in the controls that it's F for the monocular. I've been pressing F thinking I'm going to get it out or I was going to get a light source out or something. Nothing seems to be working. I guess I need to find it. I'm done with this, yeah. And, and it's done with me. We're missing a book here. Maybe more of Poe's work needs to be found? I don't know. Oh. It's okay, right. Fair enough. <laughs> oh! You sneak. That This is it. This is the photo, isn't it? It's this looking down. This is the combination. That's why he said something looked a little bit off, right? Okay, so this. This is what I'm going to note down. Okay. Alright. Okay, I think I've got that noted down. I, I guess I want to go back there. If there's nothing else to find up here, anyway. Just a load more books. Nah, nothing, nothing strikes me as too odd about the bookshelves up here, really. Uh, sorted that out. Now I've got the combination. Yeah, this is, this is good. This is really, really good. Can we go a little bit further, just out of interest? Where would this go? This would go to the ballroom. Wow. No dancing for me. No, the door's locked. I need to find a key, or maybe it's just not in the demo. Um, this way? Alright. So, still not entirely sure about this 745, or that, but I uh, should be able to open this up. So, let's see. Uh, it's going to be starting with this one, I believe. And then it goes to that. And then it's going to be the one that looks like a box. Mm-hmm, there you go. Then it's the sickle-looking one, and then it's uh, this one. Yes! That's it! We've removed the lock, and inside the box we find... Oh, this is the monocular, right. And now I can press F to uh, equip and remove it when I see a family seal. Right. Oh, very fancy. Okay. So... Ah, we can see hidden things. We can see secrets. Fantastic. So hang on. Great Britain, Cuba, Madagascar, Solomon... Ah, hang on. Right, so the three islands? Right, Solomon Island, Cuba, Great Britain, ended in Madagascar. Maybe that's what I need to do over there? Right, okay. Solomon Islands, Cuba, Great Britain, Madagascar. Okay, um... I actually do have to look at the map for the Solomon Islands, because offhand I wouldn't really know where to look, but fair enough, okay. So it's F to take that away. This is brilliant. This has certainly been a highlight of all these demos that I've played so far. Let's see if we can find the Solomon Islands. There it is. Ah, there seems to be some trigger mechanism. Okay, so what was next? It was... I think it was Cuba, wasn't it? So let's just go across here. There's the next one. Um, do we... Do we count Great Britain? I guess we probably do. Yep, I heard another click. Uh, and then it was Madagascar. Ah! This is great! Why is this all set up, though? Like... It's brilliant and everything, but what secrets are you trying to hide? Okay. Another pocket watch. This one doesn't seem to be too broken. Oh. Oh! We're setting the hours, we're setting the minutes this time. Was it 7.15, 7.45, something like that? Hold on. 7.45, can we? We should be able to. 7... 
45. Oh, a puzzle. Within a puzzle. Oh, this is great. This this is great. This is this is rubbing me the right way. <laughs> okay. So we have to do the outer ring as well. Uh is there something back there? I probably don't want to cover it up if that's the case. That looks right. And so does that, but not not quite right for this side. There you go. So if I just move this all the way around, that should be all lined up. And we find a strongbox key. It's a long golden key. It appears to be the key to a safe. Here we go. Okay, so... Uh, I'm really getting into this now. <laughs> the strongbox key. Equip. In there? Yes. So here we go. What's inside? Another will, probably. <laughs> It, it's uh, Hamlet, the tragical history of Hamlet, Prince of Denmark. Okay. Understanding my favorite passage from Hamlet is the key to beginning to understand my legacy. Interesting. Okay. That's where that passage was from. I take it, and and this is. In the manor's art room, guarded by cold, timeless heroes, lies my life's work. A priceless legacy, destined destined change the way we understand the world and the future of humanity itself. This is my true legacy and it will await eternally for the one who demonstrates the four unshakable virtues under which I directed my own life. And these are the four virtues, are they? I guess I'm looking for these four. And then I have to place them on the statues in the art room? I guess. Okay. And, and the art room is where, precisely? Sorry. Oh, it's back there. The, the, the one that I can't open. Um, and I, I don't know if I can access that in the demo, quite honestly. If I can't go through the ballroom and past the game room... I'm going to have to find a key for that door, I guess. But right. So I've got a new objective. It's... Yeah, what's the secret legacy of Mr. Strange? And it's something to do with this, because this is when the objective changed. Hamlet. Hamlet and block capitals. Ha Hamlet can... How many books were there on that lower shelf? Hold on. Do we need this on anymore? I don't know if we do, to be honest. Let's turn that off. Six. There's six. And we do have the entire alphabet. This might be it. If I, if I just put the H there... Okay, and then, right, where's M, there it is, okay, we're looking for an L, we found an L, we're looking for E and T, this has got to be it, right, right at the end here, there we go, Hamlet, yes, Oh, there's a lever. Wait, couldn't I have just... <laughs> if I really wanted to get to the lever, I probably could have just gone behind, but fair enough. What does this do? I... Oh? Oh! Was this a secret passage in the library? A little bit cliche, but I love it. And that is where the demo ends. That was absolutely fantastic. I love the puzzles, I love the way it looked, I love the audio. Listen to this music. The story is intriguing as well. This is fantastic. This is... This has really been a highlight of the demos that I've played. And I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed myself. I hope you did as well. If you did, leave this video a like, leave your thoughts down below in the comments, and I hope to see you back in another video very soon. See you then. Maybe I killed them. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so delve into the mansion and investigate why Mr. Strange appointed you as his executor. Right. Or, I could leave. Oh, I can't leave now. I've still got business to resolve. Ah, oh, damn it. And must be stopped immediately. Be fulfilled. <laughs> the old man's gaze seems to hide something. Hmm. 
Don't take this the wrong way, mate, but I kind of want to knife your face. Is there something behind that painting? The Butcher of Oxford Street. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm seeing a theme in these. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. With that. That's right! Uh, okay. Uh, uh, oh! Uh, yes. <laughs> Oh, oh, ho, 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 ho. now we're talking. So again, more books. Funny that. It's almost like it's a library. And then it was Madagascar. Ah, this is great. Yes. Oh, there's a lever. Wait, couldn't I have just... <laughs> if I really wanted to get to the lever, I probably could have just gone behind, but fair enough. 